Hi there and welcome to ZDNet. Let's talk about how to edit a PDF. You can edit a PDF using Microsoft Word or Google Docs, or you can also use Adobe.com. Let's start with how you can use Word to edit a PDF. So let's just open Microsoft Word, and then we're gonna click on open and choose the PDF file that we wanna edit. Here's the file I chose to open. Just to compare, here's a side-by-side -side view of the original on the left, which was the PDF, and how it looks when you open it in Word. So you can see the formatting didn't translate all the way to Word. So know to expect to do some formatting when you do this, but it's a completely editable document and so many people use Word already, so it's really a really great option. Saving it is the same as saving any other Word document. Just click on save or save as, and um, you can even save it as another PDF again. It's just like you would with any other document. The other option is through Adobe and you can do it through adobe.com. So once you're at the home page, you want to click on PDF and signatures and then select online tools. This leads us to all the available online tools to edit PDFs on adobe.com. And there's even more down here when you scroll down. You can choose one depending on what type of edit you need to make. One of the online tools here um, is Edit PDF. So let's click on that. This will take us to the next page. Let's click on Select a File to upload our PDF. I uploaded it and it's asking me to log in to make my edits. So I'll skip my login info along with my three attempts because I forgot my password and get to the next page. Okay, so now that I'm logged in, I can make edits and uh, this tool lets you add text or we can even highlight and add notes for corrections. You can also draw freehand and add comments and you can also fill in form files with text, uh, check mark, cross marks, uh, dots, circles, or add signatures and initials. And filling in forms is really helpful when you need to fill out a form and you weren't giving an editable PDF, which I know I've definitely been there. So to download this document, we just have to click on download on the top right corner. And remember, this is just one of the options of editing PDFs. You can do a lot with a free account on adobe.com. You just need to register with your email. Some of the few things you can't do for free is edit more than two PDFs in 30 days and edit things like text and images within a PDF, which is honestly why I'd rather use Word or Google Docs anyway, because then you can actually make edits to the whole thing. I hope this was helpful and thanks for watching.